Ever wondered how YouTube, Netflix or Twitch stream videos so smoothly? The answer is HLS or HTTP live streaming. In this short video, I'll explain what it is, why it is so powerful and then I'll show you how to set it up with FFmpeg and play it in a browser using Shaka Player. So let's see what is HLS. HLS or HTTP live streaming is a streaming protocol developed by Apple. It works by breaking videos into small chunks and delivering them over regular HTTP. Instead of downloading an entire video, your device plays these chunks one after another, which makes streaming smooth and efficient. HLS is adaptive, meaning it can switch between different quality levels depending on your internet speed. That's why YouTube and Netflix don't buffer when your internet is slow. It just lowers the resolution. So why does everyone use HLS? First, adaptive bitrate streaming, no buffering. The player automatically adjusts the quality based on internet speed. Second, works everywhere. iOS, Android, Smart TV, and all modern browsers support it. Third, great for both live and on-demand streaming. Whether you are streaming a live event or a recorded video, HLS works seamlessly. So enough theory, let's set up HLS streaming in less than a minute. This is the Ubuntu instance I'm running on my Windows. I'll use this to explain HLS streaming. Here is the command I have prepared for a quick example. In this example, the input file is an MP4 which is being used for HLS streaming. It has two variants, one is 240p, another one is 1080p. The name of the master m 3 playlist file is video.m3.8. Two separate playlist files will be generated for these two variant of stream. And after running this command from any directory, it will create the files on my Apache 2 server which is installed on my Ubuntu instance. So I'm pasting this command here and pressing enter. As you can see, the stream is being generated. It is saving on var www.html folder. Okay. So those files are newly generated. Now on my server's HTML file, I have already updated it with the help of cursor AI to generate a simple HTML page that can play HL streaming. So this uses Shaka player JavaScript library to play HL stream. And I just added this script. Here is the reference of my HLS streaming playlist file. And now if everything is saved and the Apache server is restarted and I go to my browser, go to localhost, I'll see that a page is loaded. We'll also create a course on how to develop streaming website. So for that, subscribe now. I'll see you in the next tutorial.